everybody. What if I told you that I can take C70 or R5 C log footage and turn it into Rec 709 with one click? And by the way, this is with no LUTs and no plugins. Let's get into it. So I don't know about you, but I'm not a professional colorist or some sort of guru with, you know, C-log footage. But there are ways to quickly transform your C-log footage into Rec. 709. And like I said in the beginning, this is no plugins, no LUTs. In case, you know, when you first start out, you know, LUTs drive you crazy. You pick the wrong one. You put too many on. And you just want a good, clean image quick, you know, whether it's for a quick de client delivery or something like that. So let me show you real quick. All right, everybody. So here we are on DaVinci Resolve, and we're just over on the edit page. And you can see I just brought a couple clips in using C-Log. So this first clip here of the Mic 35 millimeter is from an R5. You can tell by the video Kodak up here. And the second one is from a C70, and you can tell by the Kodak up here. So what we want to do to do one click transform to Rec. 7, Rec 709 is come up here to File, Project Settings, and instead of DaVinci for Color Science, we're going to move this over to ASUS CC. And then, of course, we need to have an output transform. And we're going to put this to Rec. 709. And hit save. All right. Now, as you can see, both of these look like garbage, but don't worry about that because we're going to come over to the color page and make sure you have your clips turned on over here in the top right. And we're going to go to the first one, right click. And instead of applying a LUT, we're going to go over here to ACES Input Transform. And I played around with this a little bit. I just happen to like how the C70 does this. So I'm going over to C7, Canalog 2, Daylight Cinema. And on the other clip here, we're going to do the same thing. Asus, C70. Canalog 2, Daylight Cinema. And there you go. That is as simple as it can be for a one-click transform. And these actually look pretty good. You could do a little bit of tweaking, but this is great just the way they are. These are very usable. So you may want to tweak them a little bit, but that's how simple this really is. So let's go ahead and uh, get back out of this. Thanks. So when I started out filmmaking or video creation or whatever you want to call it, you know, a few years ago, I looked at ASUS, but it really wasn't a good workflow for me since I didn't have any cinema cameras. Now that I have a C70, this is an excellent workflow if you need that quick turnaround for any of your videos for whatever reason, you know, either it's something you have to do fast or you just don't know how to do it. This is quick and easy. And this is in DaVinci Resolve 17, which is very popular. So hopefully you learned a little bit or at least found this entertaining. Thank you everybody for watching and for listening. I greatly appreciate it. Have a great day or night, everybody. Happy shooting. Thank you. Bye.